everyone i hope you guys are all well welcome back to my channel for another video i feel like i'm getting back into the swing of things i'm gonna be honest i did admit this on my insta stories the other week but this is actually my first full week back at work like actually working five days like i am supposed to since april <laughs> we are now in the middle of june so yeah i mean don't get me wrong i think maybe i've done like a four day week, but I do think a lot of them have been like two, three, one last week because I went up to Bramham with Gary Ann. Is somebody keen? Does somebody know what is on the agenda for today? I haven't actually told you. I haven't, but we're going and having some jumping fun. We have got a cross country lesson booked out at Porth Valley, which I'm really excited for actually. We went jumping at Coleraine on Tuesday because I just felt we haven't left the ground for a little while and I just felt like I wanted to be, I don't know, on a surface in an arena with show jumps that can come down before going and attacking the solid fences. But she was absolutely mega. I was so beyond chuffed, beyond expectations, was not quite expecting us to be like that. But I think she's actually missed leaving the ground. I have done quite a bit of schooling with her recently. So she was probably like, oh, thank goodness. I'm not just going around in a boring circle anymore. Finally, there's some jumping involved. Well, she will be happy because there is more jumping involved today. So the car is all ready loaded. Mum is coming out with me. I've got my GoPro because I've been so out of the loop of things, which feels like forever. Like since I know I went to Aston, but I still feel that was kind of just, we'll just go and have some fun. It wasn't like, yeah, it wasn't very structured. And I feel like because I've had more structure back in my week this week, I'm feeling much more like fire back in my belly. I've got diary dates. Um, there is an event that I'm entering after I see how she goes today, because I don't know whether, yeah, I don't, I don't know, basically. I'm like, yeah, the way that she jumped on Tuesday, I think, has just filled me with excitement. But like I say, car is loaded, just need to hitch up, get you out, give you a groom, and get you in the trailer. It's over in Newquay. Um, I don't know whether, I'm sure I've probably vlogged at Poor Valley before. I've definitely showed Arena jumping out there, but I don't know. I'm trying to think if I've ever made a vlog of actually their cross country course. Their cross country course is lovely. They don't actually run any competitions out there, um, but the course that they've got has got absolutely everything. It's got a beautiful water complex. It's got steps. It's got an unfinished bridge, which obviously I will not be doing today. I will show you when we get out there. Um, if we ride past it, I'll show you what it's like. But it's got like a open water ditch, just things like that, that is going to be so good for her. Because I feel that is where we are lacking at the moment. We need a bit more, and I think I said that at Lower Tolkenbury, that we just need a little bit more cross-country experience under our belts. I mean, she was absolutely fantastic at Aston. I cannot complain about that at all but just want her to see as many different kind of variety of jumps as possible so that then, yeah, you don't feel like, oh, she's never seen that before when you get to a competition. With the hope that we might actually step up to 90 this year, but hopefully I'm not putting sort of anything on it. But anyways, let's get hitched up and get off the road. It's a beautiful day here again. It's absolutely lush. Thankfully the lesson is until 6 p.m. so we are avoiding the main heat of the day but it is lush. Anyways, <laughs> tell me you're a vlogger without telling me you're a vlogger. Leads, batteries, microphones, chest strap, batteries. Oh, I said batteries. Yeah, everything there. Mum is meant to be sitting there. <laughs> right, let's get on, stop blabbing. Anybody else get a very deep satisfaction feel when you get it and it is as close as that and you're like, boom. I mean, I haven't got a camera or a mirror or anything like that. Um, I knew I wasn't quite straight, but I still managed to do it. Buzzing. Today's gonna be a good day. I'll be the one who wakes you up before you miss your ride. Cause I wanna be close to you. And I wanna show you something new. You gotta know. Every day I got your back here, you can come to me for that. So put your hand in mine.
arrived. Hello, would you just stamp in the feet? Are you being mission missing patient? Hey, where are we today? Hi. <laughs> didn't actually take, there wasn't too much traffic. I always think coming over the Nuki way in like this time of year can sometimes be a fair bit of traffic, but thankfully it wasn't too bad. I wanted to be here for half past five and it's just coming up to 25 past, so can not complain. So we're a bit early up on the hill and I can't lift it down. Here we go. Good girl. You remember this place? We weren't here that long, well actually. Time is flying by. It was probably a few months ago now. I haven't got anything sweet up. I haven't, no. But I'm going to get her out. I'm going to stud up because I just think the ground is relatively hard. So I just don't know whether it will be a little bit slippy. So I am just going to pop in a few little studs. She's only got one hole in each hoof. I was going to say foot, but they've got heat hooves. Shouldn't take me too long, but I haven't studded up for quite a while. But let's get her out, get her studded up, tacked up. I think I am the first here. Miss Organised. On time for a change. Feels a bit weird. I'm gonna show you something new. You gotta know every day I got your back. Yeah, you can count on me. Oh, you jump all the jumps, but boulders, still scary. <laughs> Good girl. Oh, it's so beautiful.
Good girl. <laughs> Oh no! Ah, ah, Get on! No. Yeah, they always jump nice, don't they? they do. Yeah. Really nice. You're on the right hand one, yeah. Mary. Yeah. And no pulling, Mary. Oh. No pulling. Oh. Just going. Go on, Mary. You're such a good girl. You don't. You wait until I tell. She's very well behaved for that. Yes, good girl. <laughs> Lovely. Good shot, Emily. So up straight up, Mary. Roll top. Great, good. And it's three strokes. Good shot. Got it. Well done. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Good girl. Well done, Emily. Good girl. Good girl. Lovely. Oh, that was a shame. I felt like she could have gone. I thought she was going. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I don't think you're overdoing it. I think you're just giving her that one more confidence run. Yeah. Pull up body on the way in. Leg now. Leg now. Good girl. Yeah. Always have a little somebody waiting for me. I think it's because you can hear Addy, can't you? Hello, hello. You okay, Bobby? You okay? Oh, you're a bit more full of energy. Is it a bit cooler now for you? Hey, you oh, good girl. Yes, Addy, I know that you are in there. Yes, I know. Hey, Sprite hasn't called you yet. Oh, where's Nana gone in my car? Thinking there's food. <laughs> oh, hi. Was you awesome? Was you a very good girl? You were. You very, very were. Oh, you've demolished that. Well done.
Oh, she's busting. She needs a wee. Hello. You okay? I'll put you out, didn't he? You're looking so good at the minute, Spritey. I feel a bit bad because I haven't been able to get her out for the past couple of days, but tomorrow she will because Addie is having a very well-deserved day off. Absolutely. I'm just walking down because I've got to open the field for them. But, oh my goodness, how good was she? Mum's like, oh, I hope I have got everything. I'm sure she has. <laughs> That's making me giggle. The train just went past, so I had to pause for a second. She couldn't. She felt like she was being left out by being up at the top. Um, but yeah, I'm over the moon. She went even better than what I was expecting. I didn't know whether she was going to go out there and be a bit spooky-fied after not seeing solid fences again for a little while. She was a little bit spooky, like at the fences when we first was just trotting around. But then she settled really, really well. Oh, and we've got another train going by. So the train track is literally just there. You can't quite see it because it's like lower down. I'm beaming, absolutely beaming. And now we'd just like to have some rain for the ground, which I think we have got coming this weekend, fingers crossed. I am gonna go home and happily enter my event for in, I think it's in a couple of weeks, first weekend of July. That's not next weekend, is it? No, the weekend after. We've got an exciting weekend next weekend as well. There are so many exciting vlogs coming up, guys. So do make sure that you are subscribed to my channel because I've got a serious pinch me moment. And that is only thanks to you guys for watching and supporting this channel and yeah, all my horsey antics because it really wouldn't be possible without you guys. So yeah, really huge thank you to you. If you have enjoyed today's video, as always, please do give it a like, cheeky comment, and of course hit the all important subscribe button. Like I said, get the, tick that bell as well. Get notified when my videos are coming out. Is the event that I'm going home and feeling confident and happy to enter will be Chepstow at Howick in a couple of weeks. And I think we're gonna go for it and we're gonna enter the 90. <laughs> Yeah, got to go for it. After the way she's just jumped, there's no reason why we can't do it. So, yeah, very, very excited. I have had a little cheeky look as well at the course pictures online as well, just to just to see what they had. And I can't think that there was anything different to what we, well, definitely what we jumped this evening. Um, but she was awesome, absolutely awesome. I'm going to go home, watch all the footage, um, keep the smile going into the weekend. Bye.